Racism is passed down from generation to generation. What can you do as parents to break this pattern? How can you teach your kids about race and racism? Here is some practical advice. Talk about it. You can use examples from daily life and the news. Mommy, that boy has brown skin. That's right. Everybody has something called melanin in their skin, which makes us come in all different colors. But under the skin, we are all the same. Isn't it wonderful that the world has so many different kinds of people? It may be tempting to try to hide the news from kids, but it's better to tackle things head on. There are things happening that are making us sad and angry. Unfortunately, some police made bad choices because of the color of someone's skin. For children in elementary school, you can focus on fairness. It's an idea they can understand. Some people don't like other people just because of the color of their skin. And it's not fair because we're all the same underneath. As kids get older, you can add more details. Because some people aren't fair, black people have gotten fewer opportunities than other people. So they have less money to buy food and take care of their needs. Black people also tend to get sick more often because they can't afford doctors or medicine. And black people are hurt by police officers at a higher rate than other people. When kids link race with value judgments, don't get angry and shut them down. Instead, probe to find out where these ideas are coming from. I only like princesses who look like Ariel, and I don't like Moana's brown hair and skin. That's interesting. Why do you think that? You can also show your kids how racist ideas hurt people. You can't be Spider-Man. You are black. Honey, how would you like it if that boy said you couldn't be Spider-Man because you have blonde hair? How would you feel? Take a look at what your kids are watching and reading. Show them movies and TV shows about heroes from other cultures. Malala Yousafzai, who Your fights Majesties. for girls' education in Pakistan. Anti-apartheid fighter Nelson Mandela from United South States. Africa. Native American warrior Crazy Horse. And Chinese martial arts hero Bruce Lee. The list goes on. Unfortunately, most children's books and shows center around white characters, but some don't if you make an effort to look for them. Lead by example and add diversity to different parts of your life. Take part in activities likely to have a diverse group of people. Hello! Hi! Remember, being not racist just keeps things the way they are now. By being anti-racist, you can help lead our children to a brighter future.